Here is a secret my father taught me some years ago when I was very, very small. Every day he would wake up, I would see him do this every day, and I would wonder why is he doing this until I ask him, Father, why do you do this every day? He said this is what was taught to him by his father, and this is what has made his life better. So I'm sharing it to you guys today. There's so many more, but I will share this one with you. He said that every day when you wake up, if you are having problems or if you want your life to be better, there's so many things we do that we don't know how it creates misfortune for us. And there's so many energies that wait at the door of our house every day for us. Some of these energies are very, very bad and some of these energies are good. But when you don't know how to harness the energy, when you don't know how to use it properly, it reacts negatively for you. Some people, the moment they wake up in the morning and they step out of their house, bad luck start happening to them. And some people, the moment they wake up in the morning and they step out, they get an accident, they get some, some negative thing will just happen. He said, because this are, this is re the reason is because there are some spirit that sits in the front of our house. There are some spirit that governs the land. There are some energies that governs the land. Now, when you don't give them libations, they make things difficult for you. So he said to me, he said, every day when you wake up, to try to make sure that you wake up at least by 3 a.m. every day or 4.30 a.m. every day. When you wake up, before you speak to anybody in your house, you should go to the front of your door. You open, you open your door like this. Before you step your feet outside, you should take water and say, My ancestors, I greet you. All the spirits that governs this land that I am in, I greet you. And all the spirit that is following me from my childhood, from my father's family, I salute you. Uh, I commit today into your hand, uh, my, my mother's spirit, my father's spirit, I salute you all. Uh, as I go out today, please let me meet favor. Any man, any woman that is thinking negative about me, my, please push them away. Water is the essence of life. Nobody can live without water. Anyone that is planning evil against me, please push them away. Uh, all the paper that is supposed to come to me that is being hanged, please let it locate me today. What I will eat today should not be a problem for me. What my children will eat today should not be a problem for me. Let money locate me. Uh, let me meet favor in the set of women, in the set of man. Any man, any woman that will favor me, please let them come my way. Any man, any woman that will bring problem upon me, please push them away. I thank you, all the spirit. I thank you. Please give me intelligence today for me to be able to know what to do and how to go about my day. Uh, thank you very much for all the things you've done for me. Thank you. Now, he said, when you do this every day, you do this every day. Every day before you step out of your house, just do this. You will see your life will change. Good luck will always locate you. This is a secret. This is a timeless secret that was passed from his father to him. And he said it to me. And I'm sharing it with you guys. Do it. Don't take it simple. Who have been asking me? how to do this Petri Tapanam. Uh, I'm going to show you guys the easiest, the easiest method at which you can do it because the other process is quite lengthy and it requires more time. But this is the easiest one because right now in this day and age, everybody's in a rush. Everybody's always busy. Everybody wants to do things quickly, quickly, so they can move on. So this you can do every, every Amavasya, the simplest, or you can do this every day. You know, the more you do every day, the better for you, the more you get, you know, uh, good blessings and good uh, benefits also. So first of all, you need to have a kalash, you know, filled with water. And uh, for people that is celebrating their birthday, you don't put a sesame seed, you don't put a black sesame seed in it because it's your birthday, so you don't do it. You don't put a black sesame seed on, on a tritia that falls on a Saturday or on a chaturti that falls on a, on a Sunday. You know, you don't put, you know, uh, uh, black sesame seed, but mainly on your birthday, you don't do that. So, well, this is the simplest way. It's a two-minute process, so please listen to me attentively. First, you have to open your hand like this, you know, you pour the water, you know, you hold the cup, uh, the, the water like this in your palm, and you pour the water from your left hand into if you're not able to use it if you're not able to sit cross leg like this it's not a problem uh you can sit on a chair no problem so you pour the water out and you you, you, you the, the water must flow from this your four uh uh, uh fingers om deva tripyatam om deva tripyatam finish then you have to recite Om Saptasar Saptasaya Tripyatam
Om Saptasaya Tripyatam. Now, when this is done, when this is done, then you have to do one, two. The water has to fall from different uh, corners. There are three corners in the human palm. One, two, and three. All right. So, please receive. Om Rishayo Nama. Om Rishayo Manush. Om Rishayo Devya Manusha Tripyatam. Om Rishayo Devya Manusha Tripyatam. Om Rishayo Devya Manusha Tripyatam. Again, Om Rishayo Devya Manusha Tripyatam. Om Rishayo Devya Manusha Tripyatam. Om Rishayo Devya Manusha Tripyatam. Alright, that is it. Alright, this is the simplest thing you can do, and it is the easiest, it is the easy way for you to be able to do this Peter Tapanam. Now, the last one you have to recite. Om Pitara Tripyatam Tebya Swadai Namaha. One Tebya Swadai Namaha. Tebya Swadai Namaha. To people that don't understand what I said, I'm going to repeat myself again. All right. Om Pitara Om Pitara Tripyatam Tebya Swadai Namaha. Tebya Swadai Namaha. Tebya Swada Namaha. Like this. Alright? So when it is done, now you pray, you know, to to your ancestors that they should please come, they should please accept this offering of water that you're giving to them. And as you're doing this prayer, you should surrender, surrender yourself that it is not you that is the doer. You know, surrender the action to you know to the lotus feet. Of the supreme personality of God, that you are not the doer, surrender your ego, so your ego does not start feeling that I am the doer, I have done something wonderful. No, surrender all the action onto the supreme personality of God. Om Shanti, 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 Hari Om. Hare Krishna. Thank you. This is the easy way. Two minutes, you can do this three tapanam on your own at home at the comfort of your home anywhere you are if you can do it every day better if you can do it once every month every amavasya also better but there are elaborate ways but this is the easy way to do god bless you and Hare Krishna.